In this video, we answer the question, should you hike Bumpus Hell Trail when you're visiting Lassen Volcanic National Park? We can pretend the time is still, stay in the daydream, chase the thrill, make up the way as we go, live for the moment, lose control. Rent a car you can't afford, put it on the wheel. Hey, you guys! Thanks for joining us on another journey. Today, we're in California at an unknown national park. At least <laughs> I'd never heard of it. Lesser known. We're in Lassen National Park in California. If you're new to the channel, this is April. Hey. And I'm Wayne. We do a video every Thursday, so hit that subscribe button and smash that bell. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the journey. We're out here hiking the Bumpus Trail. Bump ass. <laughs> That's what she's been calling it. It was more fun. True. We're in Lassen Volcanic National Park, California. And it's windy, breezy. Yeah. But beautiful. Much nicer than the temperatures back in Redding. Yeah, yeah. Redding is like 103 today. That's about 69 degrees when we left the car. We're also at 8,000 feet. 8,500 feet, actually. Maybe even a little more. Yeah, we keep going up, so we're probably getting higher. We did our due diligence and took our little aspirin, and we didn't drink alcohol last night, so hopefully. We, we won't get altitude sickness like we did before. That's just a tip for you. Take an aspirin when you're hiking at you know high before. elevation. Yeah, before you get to the trails. It just thins the blood out enough to where you, uh, you're safe. You drink lots and lots of water. Lots of water. That's Lassen Peak. We wanted to go do that trail, but it's, uh, it's a moderate to strenuous five mile hike in April. Strenuous. Okay, it's a strenuous hike. And I am hiking with an injury. The Bumpus Trail has a steady incline, so there is some elevation gain on this. 443 feet of elevation gain on the Bumpus Trail. Yeah, just a steady incline. It's not straight up and down, so that makes it easy. Beautiful views all the way. Wear lots of sunscreen, meaning uh, apply beforehand and then apply, reapply, and reapply again. Hats are a good idea too. I left mine in the car. I wanted to wear a ponytail and I can't wear my hat with my ponytail. Wayne's just burning his balding head up. <laughs> <laughs> his receding hairline. Did you get up there? Yeah, I got there enough. Enough? Maybe it'll grow some hair if it burns up. Tons of water, hiking boots or shoes with good grip. Yeah, you definitely need it on here. This is a slick trail. The loose ground, loose gravelly gravel, as April likes to say. Hiking boots definitely help out for sure. Leave those uh, tennis shoes at home. When you head out to Lassen, keep in mind that there is very little cell phone service out here. So download any of the maps and music that you're going to need uh, for your day out at the National Park. Oh, I can smell it. Can oh, you smell yeah. that? I can smell the sulfur. This is supposed to be kind of like mud pots at Yellowstone without the crowns. Well, I don't know what this geothermal area looks like specifically, but there are mud pots and hydrothermal um, areas in the park. But we'll be surprised what Bumpus has to show us. You're going to see the little chipmunks everywhere. Don't feed them. It's not good to feed the animals. Because you get some comfortable eating human food, then in the winter they starve. Yeah, they can also make them sick. Yeah, that'll make them sick as well. Kind of trippy, kind of messes with your mind, you know? You're like, wait, what? Where am I? Yeah. I'm in California, but it smells like Yellowstone. Oh, yeah, you can see the steam coming up. First glimpse. Yeah, that's kind of look 
looks like Yellowstone. Yellowstone of California. Wow, look at the colors. Oh, yeah. I actually think this is prettier than Yellowstone. Yeah. Because you get the green trees to go with it, you know. I mean, Yellowstone too, but... Hey, look at the hordes of people. <laughs> I was literally just about to say that, Mr. Interrupter. <laughs> Keep interrupting me. There's those flowers again. Oh, my God. Yeah. The smell of sulfur. Stirs the uh, appetite, doesn't it, huh? Oh yeah, it was nice. Oh yeah, that's what we had for breakfast, so. <laughs> As you're walking down to the thermal pools, you can feel the temperature and the humidity just going up. It was interesting to learn about the man who discovered Bumpus. He wishes he had never found it in the first place. Kendall Van Hook Bumpus was a hunter, cowboy, and prospector, discovered the area in 1864 while looking for some stray cattle. During his first visit, he broke through the thin crust of the earth and burnt his foot on the boiling mud pots. After he got back home, mothers asked him where he'd been. He replied, boys, I have been in hell. A local newspaper editor heard about this story and asked Bumpus to take him to the area. So Bumpus did, and this time he again broke through the crust and burned his leg so badly that he had to have it amputated. After he returned from that trip, he exclaimed to the locals, the descent to hell is easy. You get it, right? The one thing you're always gonna wanna do when you come to any of the national parks, especially at Lassen National Park, it's in the middle of nowhere. Also talking about things about being in the middle of nowhere. There's no gas stations near here. You definitely want to fill up on gas before you leave wherever you're coming from. Cheers. Cheers. Food always tastes better after a hike. Oh yeah, turkey sandwich at home is just like, yeah, okay. Out here it's like, yes, it's yeah, right? the best thing ever. We were eating lunch at the walk-in campground, the south entrance. Thought I'd give you a quick talking point. You see, you can gather wood from the area. Please do not bring any firewood from home. If you do need firewood, then buy it on site. Or pick it up off the ground. Or pick it up don't off the ground. Don't pull it off of a tree. Yeah, don't pull it off of a live tree. Or a dead tree. Or a dead tree, exactly. You don't want to burn firewood from your house. As you might have different bugs that will destroy the forest here. We filmed this video right before the 2021 Dixie Fire. Uh, unfortunately, we're sad to say that about 69% of the park had actually caught on fire, burnt uh, over 73,000 acres in, in the Lassen Volcanic National Park alone. We want to thank you guys for watching our video all the way to the end. If you would, hit that subscribe button, share it with a friend, and like always, thank you for living life.